from Austin, Texas. He is the law, Lawrence Bartello! There he is, the law of AAPW, Lawrence Batello. One half of the laws of wrestling as we saw them get a big win at last week's show, but now the law is on his own. Law repping Renegade USA. Got a match today with a man that he's familiar with all too well. Absolutely. But Law has always been the hometown hero. He's always been the guy that you can put your money on if you need a hard fought victory. He looks ready to go tonight. You got to imagine that, you know, a, a show like this adds a, a, another level of pressure. And I believe that. And he's... his opponent. From I Wish You Would, Texas, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Ray of Light, T. Ray. The, the man from I Wish You Would. Hey, T-Ray is here to let him know. Hey, hey, hey. I just hope that I hope the law is ready. I hope, that, I hope that these fans are ready. As you pointed out, definitely no strangers. These two, they have their history. But tonight, it, it's it's not about history outside of George J. Lai's legacy. Absolutely. This should be a incredible, hard-hitting, hard-fought match. The power, the absolute ferocity of T-Ray. Special guest referee for this match, AAPW legend, Steve Arino. If you look at that, Steve Arino, a special guest referee. The pinfall wizard, back to ref. you love to see it. The crowd showing that appreciation that he deserves to be shown. Absolutely, our wonderful, loyal fan base here at AEPW showing support once again. This uh, match is officially underway. Okay. Lawrence looks ready to get in there with T-Ray. I don't know if he's ready. Three years. Okay. It's three oh. years worth of a handshake. Look at this. There it is. Nice, nice uh, portrayal of showmanship there. Hey, in some places they call that honor. Okay, locking up there, T-Ray, the much bigger man, powering down Batello. Oh, yeah, look at that, just tossing him into the ropes there. Shooting him out. T-Ray, I don't know if you really can can see how big T-Ray really is through the... You know, if you're the lens at home, but that's a big old man right there. Right, if you're Patello, you gotta have some kind of strategy other than trying to outpower him. I don't know if that's gonna work. Hey, I'll say it, it probably won't. But, you know, Patello is fast, and Patello has, he has a gas tank on him, man. The guy can go, and he's smart. I mean, you know, not that T-Ray's not, but when you're that strong, you don't gotta be smart. Patello, okay. of course, very, uh, very technical wrestler, but I mean, T-Ray showing he's no slouch either. On the ground with the, the headlock. Snap married him, headlocked him, took him down to the ground. T-Ray firmly in control at the moment, but that could change at any moment. Oh, okay. look at that. Law fighting back. Got a hammer lock applied. Pulling the other arm back as well. Okay. In the middle of the ring, not a rope in sight. T-Ray's gonna have to try to fight his way out of this. You have to maneuver his way to get somewhere safe. Oh, or, or Batello <laughs> strikes the wind out of him and lets yeah, him go. That works too. Batello showing that he will not be intimidated regardless of the size difference. Man, T-Ray, you know, this is the man from I wish you would. And Lawrence is going to find out real soon if he doesn't get on T-Ray and stay on T-Ray that he going to wish he did. T-Ray going low. Bringing the law to the mat and just once again just overpowering him, just staying on him. Hey, T Ray may not be here every week, but he's been here not too long ago. If you remember the clash he had with Zeke Rose, T Ray is here now. You know, with a man who's here week in and week out, but you don't see any ring rust on T Ray. You don't see T Ray slouching. You don't see T Ray, 
you know, slacking. He's just in. Absolutely Look. not. That could have been it. Absolutely. That's the second time, second near fall that T-Ray has had. The law is in trouble right now. Okay. Got him stretched out here. Found a bit of an abdominal stretch. Oh, oh giving it back to him. Bit of his own medicine there. And once again, letting him get up just like the law did to T-Ray. I told you, when you're that strong, it don't matter what else is on the table. T Ray showing exactly what I said to be true. Okay, these men, these men are at a stalemate here. Trying to get in each other's heads, maybe. Well, I mean, Law has to think of something else now. He tried out wrestle T Ray, then he played the power game, and T Ray showed I can do that too. So what do you, what do you, what do you got for me? I mean, it looks like they're going for a test of strength now. I don't know how wise that is on Patello's part. Uh, T Ray suckered him in there. T Ray got him, and he's got him in the corner now with his will. Patello has to start thinking right here and right now, what am I going to do to get out of this? Because if he doesn't, T-Ray can just drive that shoulder straight through him all night long. Just getting the wind knocked out of him is the law. T-Ray got another thing in mind. Big time shoulder tackle. Ran through him. Absolutely. There was no give there. Ran through him like a Honda Accord at your local 7-Eleven gas station. Right into him. T-Ray. Bear hug? No. Patello countering out of it, trying to fight back here. Crowd's getting behind him as well. Forearm shots to the back of the neck. Oh, okay, right to the corner by Patello. Right to the turnbuckle, following up with those body shots. Oh. Tripping him. Slung his feet from under him. Had T-Ray thinking it was a stomach, and it wasn't. Huge shot in the corner there. He's got to get him away from the ropes. T Ray. Big, powerful kick out by T Ray. I see. I see. I see what Patello's doing here. You knock a wind. You knock the wind out of a man. He can't fight. He can't move. Exactly. Patello knocking the wind out of T Ray negates that power. Following up as quickly as he could as well, making sure he was away from the ropes. You know he did everything right, but sometimes the other guy is just too tough. Oh, bear hug. Just sending him halfway across the ring. Belly to belly, overhead suplex by T-Ray. That was almost it. Kick out by Law, but it wasn't the biggest. He's got to fight it out. Tello yeah. is in all kinds of trouble right now. Big drop kick right to the back of his head by T-Ray. You don't often see a man that size do a drop kick, but when it does, it is impactful. Every time, impactful, impressive, unapologetic. Okay, T Ray's and kick Patello out the ring like he was garbage. Just willing to get a potential count out victory here, maybe, or maybe not. Okay, T Ray looking for a. Oh, oh. Patello moving out the way. I think T Ray kind of forgot what was, what was next. What, what, what was he going to hit him with? A baseball slide? Patello wasn't having it either way. Patello got an advantage, but not for long. A huge echoing chop by T Ray. Jeez. Hey, you know, it doesn't matter what happened before. That was all that you needed. Tello getting some fight back in. And a chop of his own. You heard that one as well. That was not pretty. Man meat being smacked. <laughs> but again, T-Ray just too powerful. T-Ray just lit Batello up like the 4th of July. Throwing him right on that no. ring apron. No. Good God, what a lariat. Reminds me of something I've seen on the internet. He's already dead. <laughs> Quit hitting him. Patello is in a bad, bad place right now. He needs something big. He, he looks like he doesn't even know where he is. T Ray is in firm control, but I might have spoken a bit too soon here. It seems like Law is figuring his way back into this. Law fighting back with a big kick right to the chest of T Ray. And him back into the ring. Kick the taste out of his mouth, it looked like. This might be exactly what Patello needed. Big time flatliner off the second rope. Here's the cover. Okay, okay. T-Ray so out. close to the ropes, he still didn't need it. Had enough power just right out, man. Still got a lot of fight left in him. You know, and that just shows the kind of grit it takes to be a graduate of AEPW. You know, many many a man would have would have called it a day 
called the called the Uber, went home, saw what was on TV, and ate a chicken cutlet. Not these men. Absolutely, these men are here to fight and continue to fight. They will. Big side rush and leg sweep by Botello. And he still manages to kip up. This man still has gas in the tank. He is not done yet. Simon, this man, Botello, is not an average man. He's letting us know what time it is next. You know, Botello used to be a ref. Oh. Well, <laughs> well I guess that kind of killed the joke. T. Ray's not having none of that. Trying to show off some of those ref counting skills, but ain't gonna be none of that for T. Ray. None of that at all. He's got him by the hand. Oh, I know the, he wish he did. Uh, oh, three? Man. No, just two. Oh, there's your third one. Another Larry Big elbow. Back right elbow. The Tello going up. T. Ray holding it, counting the time. T-Ray just every time Botello gets offense in, T-Ray just cuts him off with the pass and regains control. Just punishing the man. T-Ray looking dangerous here. Is we, are we about to take it home with the full Nelson? Oh. German suplex bridge by T-Ray. Oh, looks Botello. like Botello just barely, barely got a shoulder up. T-Ray hanging on to him. Refusing to let go. Possibly another German coming up. T-Ray holding on to him like a dog on a bone. Patello oh, is in trouble. Oh, oh, the law hung on there. T-Ray slipped. Oh, the law slipped. Top of his own. Went low and then went high with a big clothesline. Not enough to keep T-Ray down. T-Ray, man, that's too much man for one clothesline to drop. But if you notice, he's, he's, he's not kicking out with as much fervor as before. He is running a little low on gas, I imagine. If you're Lawrence Patello, what do you do to, to put someone like T-Ray away? You keep, you keep the pressure on. You cannot let T-Ray get back in control. Another side rushing and another kip up. Is what you want to do right here. You want to knock the wind out of T-Ray. Because if he gets back up, he's just going to throw you down and slow you down. Well, the wind might be knocked out of him now after those three consecutive chops. But no, T-Ray still kicking out. Yeah, Batello used to be a ref. <laughs> you know, I was going to tell you that. Batello used to be a ref. Uh, Absolutely. Got a really good three count on him. Showing off those recount abilities <laughs> showing off that knowledge now t-ray i said it i said it he's gassed if patello can keep the pressure on he might can win t-ray just needs to slow this thing back down oh that's my not knee. gonna do it big knee by patello oh no what the, looks like the referee says two two i think there was a miscommunication Possibly, it looked like it might have been 2.99999. Referee it, saying it was just two. It was just two. I guess the match continues. Botello, that might have been it. That might have been Botello's only shot to win here. Look at the agony on his face. What happens now? And, and look at, as, as the confusion, more time goes by and T-Ray has more time to recover. That's exactly right. Botello has to end this. He has to know if he needs to end this or not. See? He oh, waited too long. Yeah. T-Ray got his gas back. Oh, my God. Just wrenching the leg. Got him in that heel hook there. And that knee bar, I mean. Botello, he got he to gotta be careful, man. Guy like T-Ray, that much strength, he decides to crank it in there. That'd be it. Can Botello make it to the ropes? He's in a bad, bad spot right now. Just imagine the agony of, of a man that size just wrenching away at your leg, but he makes it. He makes it to the bottom rope. T-Ray had Botello at, at, his, at his rights, at his mercy, but Botello's got that fight in him, man. As some would say, he got that dog in him. Look at, look okay. at Botello here. Small package. Back to another small package. Back to back. T-Ray got him up. F5. Just absolutely flattened him. 
Oh my lord! Patello refusing to stay down. You mentioned that he's got a very large gas tank. Hey, I was ready to call it. I wish you would kick out. But Lawrence Patello will make a believer out of you yet. T Ray setting him up. Possibly yeah. looking to end things here. Oh, got him set up for kind of like a Canadian backbreaker. So he's looking for a power bomb. But what is it? Oh! Either way, Paul oh, fights out of it. That's it. That's gotten the law many wins. Oh. Oh. Like a bit of a hesitation. Nah, nah. Lawrence understands what's necessary here. You give him one, T-Ray kicks out at 2.999. You can't have it. You give him another one. Finish. You want to keep him down. And that's going to do it. Law breaker. Two in a row. Your winner of the match, the law. Win for Lawrence Patello. That man is on a roll for sure. Lawrence Patello, you know, I said it at the start of the match, and he, he demonstrated every step of the way he had to outgas T Ray, and he did exactly that. He wore him down, he endured the punishment T Ray laid on him. Did you see those hits? Absolutely. Look at this. Oh, oh. Lawrence trying to show some some camaraderie here. This is, after all, the Georgia Lays the Legacy Show. This isn't about past hostilities. This is about Georgia. And I, I, I'm wondering if T-Ray is going to take him up on, on, on the truce for tonight at the very least. Yes! T-Ray looking a bit conflicted, but eventually cooler heads did prevail there. Hey, for the sake of George, I think we should all let past grudges go ahead and lie tonight. I agree with that. It's been a wonderful show so far. There's the man, George Lace. It's a wonderful show at AAPW Heat Wave. We hope that you at home are enjoying it. Hope that you're uh, just, man, as honored to be here as we are. And we're still just getting started. That's right. We got another match coming up here next as we're going to send it here to the ring. There's a raw, hard-fought victory by that man. Send it to the ring to Michaela Kane.